morning guys so it is seven o'clock right now or quarter after seven and i've been trying to get the first day's vlog up all night i've been waking up numerous times at night and checking my computer and seeing the status of the video and it's at like a thousand minutes remaining and i'm like this is insane the internet connection is so slow here and i now up load HD videos so that takes a lot longer than it normally does so I'm gonna try one more time this is what we're working with right now uh, I just tried again and uh, let's let that focus 1% 196 minutes remaining wow it's again not that beautiful of a day but I wish it this would focus because the sunrise is really, really beautiful. Just fingers crossed, this is my last time trying. But if not, then I'm going to have to upload these videos after vacation. And that just makes me sad just thinking about it. Because I've been so excited to do these videos. I don't know exactly what the plan is for today. But I do have to get ready. Um, I need to eat something. And everybody else is sleeping still because I'm just trying to get this video up. So I'm going to probably just get ready in a little bit. So... I won't keep my family waiting. I'm always the one that takes forever to get ready. So I'm just going to try this again and just hope for the best right now. It's really not looking too bright. My future's not looking too good. <laughs> hey guys, so I got ready and I did my makeup and we're just going to go. Hold on, let me see. Where are we going? Where are we going? Target. We're going to Target. Are we going anywhere else? Well, shopping. Okay, so we're going shopping to Target, and I just want to show you guys my outfit quick. It's nothing special because it's rainy here today, and it's, I can't wear any of my like cute dresses or anything like that, so that's kind of sad. So I'm wearing just a white v-neck. I love v-necks. They're like probably my favorite thing ever because um, I was wearing one yesterday too, but this one is from Old Navy. I'm wearing kind of lightly distressed focus. Lately distressed jeans from American Eagle. They fit me the best there, so I love these. And then I'm just going to probably wear my black flip-flops again. So again, nothing special. But I did do my makeup a little bit better today. And then I curled my hair. It's fallen out quite a bit. But I love my loose curls when they fall out. So that is what I'm wearing today. And we're just going to go shopping. I'll take you guys along with me, of course. And... Yeah, I don't know. I, I think I want to try to find some stuff because we're going to go to Plato's Closet, I think. And I'm going to try to find some cute clothes there that I can wear in case it's cold here again. I only brought summer things to wear, like so many pairs of shorts. I'll talk to you guys when we actually are out doing something. Look at how beautiful it is right now. It's kind of foggy, but it's really, really nice. Also, a little nature hike. If you guys enjoy hiking, uh, rock behind us. Hi, dear. Oh, hi. It's like so. It's not even. It wasn't even scared. Look at it. It looks like a freaking horse. So, my mom's currently pushing me on a carriage, right? Yep. And we're, oh, mom, I almost fell backwards. <laughs> I really am so tired. I'm like, mom, can you just push me? I was, I asked if I can get into the carriage. She's like, just get on. That she's embarrassed. Look at her face. <laughs> see, wait, let me see. Oh my gosh. Oh, it was tipped over. Yeah. Come on, Lisa. Wait, a... can you just push me, mom? Just like push and let go. I'll do it down here. Go, 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 it. go. It's tip. <laughs> um, so I'm getting three things. I'm getting this kimono. I think it's so cute. I have one that's similar to it, but it's actually the same length and everything, but it's a different print. I really like it. We're in Target, by the way. I think, and you can tell. Then a black skater skirt, which I feel like will go with everything. Like this shirt, for example. So, I'm getting these. Also. Why are you laughing at me? Okay, you're taking it? What are you, what are you doing with it, though? So all you do is just, you get, yeah, they're only like 54 cents. We can buy them. Like, Where'd you like, get them? 
Yeah, they, yeah, they won't know. Like, you know, like, we could have a baby at home. They don't know. Like, I could have a child. They don't know. That's true. Maybe I like eating baby food. They can't judge like us. Like coats. Oh, sale. Limited time. What is this? Apple mango. Mm. Mango. I hate mango. My dad was asked one simple task to grab a carriage, and this is what he grabs. You gonna hop in? Sure. Right. My sister has a story to tell, and I think that she needs to tell it because I think it'll help with like letting it out. We're just at Kohl's, and um, this lady came up to us, all of us, all four of us, and asked us if we were gonna sign up for a credit card. But my parents both have each have a credit Kohl's credit card. And Paige uh, and I said no because we don't want one. We don't want one. So, and then I'm over looking at these T-shirts while my while the rest of all them are in um, the line. And she comes up to me again and she goes, "Would you like to sign up for a Kohl's card?" And I'm like, uh, uh, "I don't think so. I'm thinking I'm gonna pass." And she's like, "Well, all these all these great benefits you get with it, um, it would really help out the store. And we all have." Or, and you get Kohl's cash and you save all this money and stuff. And I'm like, oh, I, th I think I'm going to pass this time. Sorry. And she's like, mm-hmm. And just like walked right away. When she came back and told me that, I know how my sister is. I was walking around trying to find the lady and have her come up to me. I was going to be like, listen, I don't want your freaking Kohl's card. Okay. I, I'm about to smack you with this new purse that I got right across the face. Um... If you ever talk to my sister like that again, um, I'll make sure to shove that Colts card right up here. I'm always in the toy section when I'm recording in a store, but I just got some stuff for a giveaway. If you are watching this, you're getting a little sneak peek. So this is going up very soon. Um, so that's all I'm. That's all I'm showing. I'm not gonna get into it. Coming up on my main channel, so make sure that you're subscribed, and I'll have it linked below. And. I think you guys can kind of guess from what I just showed you. But you guys, yeah, get a sneak peek. And if you follow me on Twitter, then you'll know that I'm also having a giveaway. So also follow me on Twitter. Self-promotion at its finest. Okay, I'm scared. I'm scared. You're looking down your shirt. Mom, no. <laughs> this song came on in the store. It reminds me of somebody. And if you're watching this, you know who you are. Rascal Flats, come wake me up. Hey guys, so I just wanted to quickly talk to you guys for a little bit because this is going to be the end of today's vlog, which I hope you guys enjoyed. I know it was a lot of footage from the stores and stuff, but that's basically all we did today because it was raining out today, so we just took that as a day for shopping, and then we're going to be doing the fun stuff when it decides to be nice out, but I just feel like holding the camera like this, so... Hopefully you guys don't mind wearing my Demi Lovato t-shirt. As some of you may know by now, Robin Williams was found dead and it was supposedly suicide due to depression and everything. And I really, really just wanted to talk to you guys about that because it's crazy to me because I had just watched one of his movies literally a week ago. Never would have thought there's so many people in this world that are struggling with depression, um, other mental illnesses, self-harm, bulimia, anorexia, and you know everything that aren't speaking up and are basically struggling in silence and it's it's crazy to me because I had no, like I ex did not expect that or suspect that at all. So basically, if you are watching this video and you are currently struggling with something, whether it's bullying, um, if you're a victim of bullying, self-harm in whatever aspect, tell somebody because you can get your life in control and back to the way it should be. And I mean, I preach this because the person I look up to does. Basically what I'm saying is that if you are dealing with something, speak up because you could save your own life. And I don't think if you ask for help, that's a sign of weakness. I feel like that just shows true strength. So I just wanted to talk about that quickly because it's definitely something that hits 
me hard for sure my family like we were just sitting there kind of like wow I can't believe that this happened so because I you know a lot of us probably grew up with his movies and whatnot so it's just crazy and I hope that you guys enjoyed the second vlog in my follow me around Virginia vlogs and tomorrow again I don't know what we're doing we don't like plan out anything we just just we just wing it I don't know if we're going to go to the water park, there's uh, go-karts, mini golf, horseback riding, just so many different things that I want to do on this vacation. So I hope that you guys are enjoying this video and give it a thumbs up if you are so I know and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's vlog. See you guys later. She's